An elevator. There's a lot more to this place than I thought. Come on, get on the elevator, Lydia. What are you complaining about? Oh, Falmer! Gollum is down here! I am not a fan of those dudes, but... All right, now that was a heck of a shot. I uh, I might take a moment to pat myself on the back because that was quite a shot. I've never seen anything quite like that. Yeah, I I'm not quite sure what you're referring to, Lydia, but uh, it's uh, something else. What's in here? Do you have any goodies in here, Mr. Falmer? Not at all. Everything you have is gross. Lydia, get out of the way. Don't uh-oh me. You silly person. Alright. Is this the one that we already looted? It is. I don't want your bunk-ass sword. Those are gross. My sword is awesome. And my dagger is super cool, too. That guy, like, hopped out of one of the holes on the wall. That was weird. Do you have any? Oh, you have the arrow I shot you with. That's kind of nice. You have anything in your little hut? No, you don't. Oh, gosh, that looks gross down there. I don't want to go there. Well, let's go this way. Goodness gracious, I am tearing these guys up! Uh, I don't really want any of that junk. What do you have here? Anything worth taking at all? No. Wait, what's her name? Coughs a lot. I mean, I'm not a big fan of how it smells either, Lydia, but you don't hear me make a noise and complaining about it. Alright, let's go through the big door here. Gotta find this, uh, this woman's sword. Because I really want to have her as a companion. She is supposed to be an awesome companion. wonder if Lydia knows that we're doing this so I can replace her. I mean, that... That makes me think that she probably would not... Go forward with this. This looks like a church. Oh, there's a bunch of these dudes here. Hi, Gollum. Thonk. Got him, too. Isn't there another guy there? Is he just like... Okay, no. That's not a guy. Okay, not sure what that is. This totally looks like a church. I, should, I could go up here and, like, give the homily. Uh, I don't want any of that other junk you have. I'll take your arrow. I'll totally take your gold. Take that. And that.
Oh, there's another one. Boink! I'm starting to get to be, or, or get to that point where stealth archery is just too powerful. It is, it is just overpowered. Because, I mean, I, from, ooh, he's got a little trap set up. I mean, if I am well concealed and all that, I I can rip up just about anything. I uh why am I picking up Falmer arrows? They only do seven. They only do seven damage. Ah, oh, I should not be carrying them around at all. Although I guess arrows don't weigh anything, so it's not like it hurts. Can I get in here? Flawless Ruby. Oh, that's awesome. We'll take that for sure. Is there anything in the other one here? Like another chest or a dead bandit? What were you doing in there? Is there a prisoner? Oh, God. They were probably going to eat him. That's gross. Did you have... Oh, you just had the chitin, which I'm 100% not interested in. You could probably make armor out of it or whatever, but I'm just not at all interested in making armor out of bug. All right. That's three. Well, it is about after five, which is uh, after five my time, that is, which is really about when I wanted to be calling it a, a day. Human flesh. Ew, Grody, you guys are disgusting. They have three chests, though. I mean, that's worth looking into. Take it, take it. Um, I guess. Why not? It doesn't hurt, I suppose. Take that. Yes, yes, yes. And no, I don't really want that. Here's the other dead people. Take your junky ass arrows. Okay, I thought maybe that was something, but it is not. What is this? Man, this is a much bigger dungeon than I expected. Alright, well, I guess I'm going to have to go up there. I really thought this was just going to be something like where, you know, I could pop in, wander around a bit, and boom! I would find the sword, and it is really deep. Did I not surprise him? I must be invisible. I must have that blessing of invisibility or whatever it's called. Because that guy was staring right at me and did not see me. That is gross. Is 
Let's see, can we open this? Unlock gate expert. All right, well, let's quick save and then let's destroy some locks. Or lock picks, rather. All right, starting to feel like it is not it is not this way at all. All right, so let's turn to the right and see what happens. There we go. That wasn't so bad. What is this? Oh, that's just their armor. Which I'm not at all interested in picking up. So that's a chair? How weird. Uh, it, it looks sort of like an end table. It did not look like a chair. Oh, a chest. That is just junk. It's so weird. Sometimes they put just the most worthless crap behind a really complex lock. Was there a, a lever or something back here that... I mean, maybe that was the thing, is that there was a lever here that I needed to hit to open those portcullis down there. I'm not seeing it. All right, let's head on back down. Ooh. I'm not sure what that did, but let's go find out. Oh, it did open up what we wanted. <laughs> Gloom Lurker? Oh, one of those is right through his neck. Oh, that was glorious. Hey, let's take a moment to uh, charge up Jim the Bow. Uh-oh. I just dropped Jim the bow. <laughs> Oops. Sorry, Jim. Sorry. We'll have to re-favorite, I think. And then... Put him on the number one slot again. That was embarrassing. I hope Jim is not upset. It was just a mistake, Jim. There we go. So what's the Gloom Lurker got? He's got... Crap! You suck! Gloom Lurker. I mean, your buddy had better things than you. At least he had some money and some gems and stuff. You had crap. Uh, that seems like the way to go. Although, there's a door here. Unlock door, adept. Maybe we'll come back to that. Uh, those guys are dead. So, and that makes me think that we've been that way. Was it this? Was that the door? This was the door. Okay. 